Hello, dear Aries. Today I am ready and prepared for this reading, with advice, revelations, and tarot prophesies for you. I hope you are doing very well. I thank you infinitely for your presence, for your likes, and your beautiful comments. Of course, also for your subscription. It really makes me very happy that you are here. Please stay until the end. If you are here, it may not be by chance. Maybe there is a message that you need to hear right now. Remember that you are the owner of your future, and you are free to make your own decisions. Keep in mind that these messages are general. If they do not resonate with you, let them go. Now let's look at the energies that are developing in different areas of your life, such as love, money, health, and family. First, I leave you with the tip of the day. What counts today is not the result, but the learning you had when reaching that goal. The past comes back in some way and nostalgia invades your thoughts. Therefore, you will be aware of someone from your past. However, do not lose something safe for something that you only enjoy at the moment. Do not give in to temptation. You love having the presence of the people you love the most by your side, especially one that has only filled you with joy, fun, and shown you new things. You will do everything possible to keep sincere friendships by your side and keep negative people away. In terms of health, it is not about limiting food, nor about following a strict diet. The only thing you have to do is moderate quantities and not exaggerate when eating. In terms of love, Little by little you will recover the good relationship with your partner and it will be time to show him, her that you are really interested. Do not be afraid to venture into new and fun things. You are the right age to live things intensely. If you are single, you want to meet new people who bring different things to your life. You know that most people are ordinary and offer nothing different. Therefore, they are not what you are looking for in a relationship. Right now, the priority will be to guide your family in the right way. There are things that you should pay special attention to. If you have children, you have to get close to them and guide them. You may also have to help parents or siblings who are going through difficult times. Be very careful about how you spend your money and in whose hands you leave the management of your finances. Below are your lucky numbers and color for today. But first, I invite you to leave me a like. Your support encourages me to continue with my readings, hoping to help you in your daily life. Your ruling numbers for today are 89 and 3. Try to use them as much as possible. Take advantage of them since they will only be with you for today. If you have the opportunity to participate with these numbers in a drawer, don't miss the chance to do so. Your lucky color for today is gray. Try to wear some clothing in this color or you could wear an accessory that contains it, as this will bring luck to your day, and it will also make you look incredible. If throughout the day you have to choose something that contains this or another color, do not hesitate to choose the one that contains your lucky color. Today is a good day to organize your mind and the words that may come out of it before speaking. Your ability to give praise can be your greatest asset to achieve great things. In fact, you have the advantage and talent that many people already know, let's say, the verbal innocence that usually characterizes you. However, you might inadvertently direct a hurtful comment at the wrong person today. Be very careful if you're going to negotiate something or talk to someone you haven't communicated with in a long time. They might not remember that you have that special spark all the time. Although, of course, you don't do it with malice since you have a heart worth all the gold in the world, or without any intention of hurting anyone, you might feel bad for having made someone feel uncomfortable. So, think before you speak. The good news is that it can be avoided. If you feel like you're going to say something wrong today, remember this and shut your mouth for a moment. The best thing to do, if you have to talk to someone, is to admit from the heart that maybe it's not your day or try to correct some points if the situation is improving. In other areas of your life, you'll feel more secure. Remember that you are a sign that is very driven by security and ways of understanding things. Also, 
remember not to beat yourself up too much with issues that are not relevant. The worst thing you could do is to repeatedly hurt yourself for things you did in the past that no longer have any influence. It is very common to put money in a safe place, but today make sure that the financial institution or place where you invest it is the right one. Today your charisma will be at its peak. It is the result of rest and the enthusiasm with which you face the days to come. If you share this stage with your man, it will be a good time to evaluate if your daily life works as you expected. Today the stars favor moments of romance for Aries. If he talks to you about future projects, don't be afraid and cut him off. Let him explain, because you may begin to realize that he fits you like a glove. You are saving well and you're not doing badly with money, Aries, but enjoy it a bit. You're going to put yourself to the test by looking for new challenges at work. You'll do very well. Teamwork can solve many problems for you at this time. A special magnetism will emanate from you that will win over whoever you want. You'll feel like a fish in water in everything related to matters of love. It's time to give free rein to your imagination and seduction. You'll finally get over the bad times and find the stability you're looking for. The stars can give you some nervous tension. Take things easy. You'll enjoy your sense of humor today and so will others. You're doing too many things and overdoing it. Calm down a bit so that your health doesn't suffer. You think you have plenty of energy, but you don't want to overdo it. Take care of yourself. Today you'll want to take flight in a relationship and also in something new, like an attractive business or financial matter. Follow your intuitions, but don't forget to do it with intelligence and a lot of common sense. Aries, something you hear today could worry you. Maybe it's a rumor, gossip, or a malicious word. The truth is that you shouldn't believe it right away and much less fight with the person you love by letting yourself be carried away by these destabilizing comments. The prevailing energy in your sign forces you to insist if something doesn't go as you wish. It's a really positive day to make a different plan for fun or some aspect that now invites you to connect with joy or happiness in your relationships, keeping in mind that Venus is now also transiting your fifth house. This makes it a very positive time for your relationships. If you have a partner, today is a very fortunate day to make plans together that can now help you experience new forms of pleasure. Or if you don't have a partner, take advantage of this waning moon in the sign of Leo, illuminating your fifth house, to meet new people, because you won't regret connecting with people who can now make you enjoy yourself immensely. It is a day when you finally decide to free yourself from the chains that have bound you for so long. You feel a strong inner impulse that leads you to break away from everything that has kept you controlled, manipulated, or caged. It is as if a powerful revelation showed you that the path you have been following is no longer the right one and that it is time to seek a new direction, one that is more aligned with your true self. This impulse is not a simple impulsive reaction but a deep awakening. Today, more than ever, you realize that you deserve something better, that you do not have to settle for less than what you are worth. This awareness gives you the strength to move forward without looking back, to say enough to everything that does not make you happy and to actively seek what does make you happy. For your health, the most direct astral influence will make you more daring than ever and you will want to experience the feeling of adrenaline in your body. You will probably feel the uncontrollable desire to push the accelerator more than usual, practice some extreme sport or get into some street trouble. Above all, try to make sure that if you feel like feeling adrenaline, you do it in line with the things you do now. Specifically, get your desire to take a risk by getting on a roller coaster or starting some martial art, even if it is from home. But do not get yourself into tension, that is, be careful with risky sports. You should also be very careful not to overindulge in drinks, whether caffeine or coffee. Although it is fine to have one or two coffees a day, be careful with those who drink four, five or six coffees a day. You may not realize it now, but over time this can cause conflicts. 
Choose well when it is best for you to uncork the bottle of success. At work, being a rebel without a cause is not favorable. Avoid misunderstandings with your bosses, supervisors, or superiors, or simply contradicting authority. If you do, you probably won't be the only one to suffer. Naturally, everyone tends to like you, and it is common for the people around you to develop such great loyalty to you that they end up supporting you in any cause. Since you are a born leader, you must take responsibility for containing your revolutionary impulse, because you would only achieve that you and your colleagues are sanctioned or lose some kind of remuneration. Be careful with the revolutionary impulse that sometimes arises. Take care of your own business, and if you are leading a team, your reasoning will be high. With your desire to revolutionize everything, you will give 1000%, so it is important to focus on carrying out your tasks quietly and being at the top of your abilities. If you are looking for a job, this revolutionary spirit will make you focus on what is vital to you, on what you can change or improve in your environment. Nothing more, nothing less. In terms of the financial sphere, your focus on the financial sphere will be key. You may face a situation that is not as satisfactory as you expected, either in the form of disappointing news or a result that does not meet your expectations. This may cause you some discouragement, but it is essential that you do not allow these negative emotions to influence your performance. Remember that setbacks are temporary and what really matters is how you deal with them. The Seven of Cups suggests that, despite this setback, new opportunities will open up. These opportunities may arise unexpectedly, so you should keep your eyes open and not let yourself be distracted by momentary discouragement. If you manage to stay focused and not let yourself be carried away by frustration, you could come across interesting proposals that will improve your financial situation in the short term. In addition, this day is a good time to rethink your long-term financial goals. It is a good time to evaluate whether the plans you have been following are really bringing you closer to your objectives. If you feel like something isn't working as it should, don't hesitate to make adjustments. Luck is on your side if you decide to take control and make the necessary changes. Lastly, don't spend impulsively today. Although the temptation to buy something to lift your spirits may be strong, it's better to save your resources for something more meaningful that may arise later. Prudence in managing your money will bring you greater rewards in the future. In terms of love, remember that your partner also has a different way of seeing life, regardless of whether he or she is of the same sign as you or not. Remember that everyone is born with a different sky, with planets in a different position. You must behave based on your own knowledge, the way you treat each other, managing emotions, etc. Maybe you have a different way of expressing your love than your partner. That adult part that comes to the surface will help you carry out tasks and responsibilities in a timely manner, so that your partner continues to maintain his or her attraction to you. Buy yourself a diary or activate some kind of reminder, write down anniversaries, important dates and remember to have details with him or her. These types of actions make the difference. If you are single, the position of the stars indicates that the chances of meeting a special person are very high. It is very common for people of your sign to be more daring than other signs, but to be inexplicably afraid of too strict a commitment. You should give a chance to a middle ground in love and try to have more than one perspective on it, because you don't know how it will turn out. You may meet someone and not know if you will end up living together or it will simply be a relationship in which each one lives in their own house. It will depend on the personality of that person and also on what you want. So don't close yourself off to possibilities because anything can happen, and for you they will all be fine. You need someone who loves you with their heart in their hearts, that is, with maximum optimism. In the family realm, today is a good time to address any conflicts or issues that have been lingering. 
The Queen of Wands suggests that your ability to communicate clearly and respectfully will be key to resolving any misunderstandings. Take the opportunity to strengthen your family relationships and foster a harmonious atmosphere at home. It's important to remain open to the needs and feelings of others and to work on building a solid foundation of mutual support. In terms of energy, your energy is normal. You will probably have a little trouble getting up in the morning, so you will have to get a little more active. The positive situation that you have to enhance today is that it is a great time to improve the way you approach people and the way you comfort them. Through practice, you are better than you think at giving advice and supporting those who need it. You just have to dig a little deeper into your own experiences, because you will do great. On the negative side, be careful of the imperative need to expose your body to any kind of stress. What I mentioned before is important. Take care of yourself, because the stars indicate that luck will not be on your side if you push your body to the limit. Also be careful about investing your money in unsafe places, as this can lead to a financial loss from which it will be difficult to get out. Keep your money safe. For students, it's not a bad thing to have taken some kind of break between classes. Try to establish new important study patterns and new behaviors. Try reading different books, watching different lectures. If you're starting a course, module, or degree, you may find it difficult to sit still for so many hours if you haven't done so before. But don't worry, as you progress, you'll get used to it. It's all about habit. As for compatibility, today you have a wonderful day with these three signs. First of all, with people of the sign of Cancer. You have a day of subtlety and understanding, and any situation that needs clarification will probably be cleared up today. Secondly, with people of the sign of Pisces. You have a day of positive sentimentality and sharing great moments. Thirdly, with people of the sign of Virgo, you have a stable and sensible day. Dear Aries, this was your reading for today. As always, thank you so much for being here with me. Remember that the purpose of our predictions is to guide you, so that you can make more appropriate and correct decisions based on them. If you like these sessions, click on that like button. You can also subscribe and activate notifications so you don't miss the daily predictions. I hope you have a day full of positive manifestations. A big kiss to everyone.